Labels. Oh, yes. Labels. Fuck. I gotta get in it. Labels. Really? Bruh. They're the messengers of classification. Excuse all of the background noise. I gotta say the obligatory shit because I got people that want to be fucking sound engineers because I got all the content creators listening to my shit. Yeah, brothers. Back to the labels. They can stretch further than that. The label as merely the word itself label can fly miles, miles and miles across the world, an ocean, through just antenna and wires and shit. We call it Wi-Fi and internet. Fuck, it's just the word label itself, man. I haven't even given you the labels yet. The word, that, that five fucking letter word is fucking me up in the first goddamn sentence. Anyway, it grinds my gears, man. It fucks me up, man. It, it grinds my gears to learn that newly red-pilled males that do happen upon the manosphere and shit, when he, when he listen to our shit. Now, I, I would like to say, yeah, hmm, I, I don't like to get into this 1.0, 2.0, see, again, labels. See what I just did there? It grinds my gears to learn that newly red-pilled men get the manosphere all fucked up because of labels. I didn't come into this shit because of that. But you got to easily identify your terrain, right? As shitty as this may sound, man, it's gonna take the fall of Western civilization as we all know it for feminism to die because gynocentrism is not. You might as well hang that fucking thing up. Gynocentrism is gonna die when we all fucking die. And when I mean we all, I mean us humans, man. Do you get it? God, dog. And we're getting pretty close to that right now. I'm sitting in this laundry mat. You want to know why? Airing out the dirty fucking... Never mind. Looky there. Labels. Whether it's incel, D-boy, cuck, simp, redneck, blue-pilled, normie, red-pilled... Hell, fuck it, MGTOW, throw that shit in there. Gynocentrism, fuck gynocracy, throw all that shit in there, right? When I say these labels, what did you think? The gynocracy paralyzes a man even down to the very fact that we say gynocracy. When have you heard a MGTOW man say gynocracy? You know when. Not that far, not, not that far off, not that long ago, right? No wonder these same as the feminist type idiots that smear us, right? And I know I'm saying right or like, fuck you. I'm drinking. I'm saying this shit. Let me play with labels my way for a minute. Cause they're a simple way to describe things, right? Blue Pill has a way of describing things. Watchers of this channel get it, right? Normie, it has a way of describing things. Watchers of this channel get it, right? Alpha, Beta, Sigma, Omega. They have a way of describing things. Watchers of this channel get it, right? Red pill, blue pill, purple pill. Watchers of this channel get it, right? Or do they? 
Remember what I said in the holiday special that we're all spokes in this wheel? We roll, MGTOW, but don't get my tribal speak all fucked up. That's the O in that acronym. We'll be careful for what that can do when you let these labels stifle your individuality. Be a man going his own way. Men going their own way, that, that's a fucking classification. We dropped it ages ago. I only say it, man, because I'm a channel just starting up. Yeah, I did it for the views. Who the fuck didn't? Who the fuck isn't? But those that have moved on from it are living it and not talking it. Now, don't get it twisted. The series will still be named with the acronym MGTOW's Self-Directed Warfare. You get it, right? But it's not like I'm going to name every episode MGTOW. That's the O in that acronym. It's not a diss record. This is not a diss video. This is none of that. This is for all men. I'm not even gonna shield the fucking channel at this point. You know what the fuck to do.